All right, amigo, I've got a perplexing situation and I want your opinion on. So here we have two cylinders. Carbony. Very clean. The engine's got a few thousand miles on it. That's it. Um, so you look at that and you go, oh, that's a lot of carbon, but that's a, not a lot of carbon. That's what's confusing me. Considering that the ports look like this, or the chambers. Now this is the clean piston chamber, and that's the dirtier piston chamber. Like, okay, so the clean one stays clean. That makes some sense. But then look at the ports. Here's the exhaust port of that one. Oil for days. There's so much oil and soot in here. And if you look at the base of the valve, um, I can't really get it very well right now, out of focus. But uh, there's oil in there. There's oil powder. This whole thing is just tons of oil in there. This side looks normal. No amount of carbon. Not a whole lot of oil or anything. But this got oil on the valve stem, on the valve seat, and everything. And then in the cylinder we have a little more oil. Uh, you can see the oil's been burning. You got the soot, the ashiness, right? especially on this side over here. Lots of ash. That one you can still read, you know, all the marks on it. So why is the clean cylinder burning oil? That's my question. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Why is the one that's the cleanest have the most oil burn? And there's a little bit of oil in here, so I'm kind of wondering if it's a valve seal. Uh, valve stem seal issue or not, but it's just really, really bizarre, and I'm trying to figure it out.